Sacred Mountain is a local martial arts dojo or studio tucked away on San Francisco Street. They believe the skills they teach go beyond just learning and a bunch of moves. Well, let's practice it a couple times. This is chop, palm, punch. The dojo is owned by Matthew Banks, who says he was inspired by his mentor to start to make the martial arts his life's work. I can't see myself doing anything else but sharing this, this art and this passion that I really love and care about. Despite the stereotypical images surrounding Kung Fu, Bang says this sport carries many life lessons. It builds self-confidence in a person that makes them feel secure in themselves. Can give people a positive path to learning how to achieve goals outside of the mat. Kung Fu translates to skill acquired over time through hard work and effort. Kung Fu doesn't actually mean fighting and punching and kicking. Student. Aiden Whittakin says he really wasn't all that interested in sports until he found Kung Fu. <laughs> so seven years ago, I quit swimming. I told my parents who really wanted me to work out and they wanted me to exercise. And I told them I wouldn't because I didn't want to do any sports. I didn't want to play football or soccer or anything. And then they asked me, OK, fine, what will you do? Um, and I said, Kung Fu. <laughs> I assumed they wouldn't be able to find a Kung Fu school. I was wrong. The inclusivity at the dojo is what drew him to the art. Uh, Kung Fu is for everyone. Um, it doesn't matter your age or body type or anything. He is not the only one who joined Sacred Mountain to become part of a community. I came here to Flagstaff uh, pursuing a career at WL Gore, the medical device company here in town. and. I, as a fully-fledged, now independent adult, searching for a sense of community. Faith Rodriguez, NAZ Today.